Good evening, you're watching Hungary Reports, kicking off public media and one's foreign language news hour. I'm Marcia Thun, thanks for joining us. An epidemiological protocol is being prepared for the start of the next school year at the educational institutions. The ministry has already prepared a detailed briefing, which will be sent to the schools shortly. The ministry also emphasizes that they are preparing for beginning the school year in a traditional way and according to normal working schedule. But the situation in respect to the coronavirus is being monitored constantly. Streets are empty at the settlement of Mecheknádasd in Baranya County. Whoever can stays at home in order to avoid contracting the coronavirus. Six individuals of a family have been infected by COVID-19 in the settlement. They were on vacation in Croatia. However, they probably didn't acquire the virus there. A visitor's ban has been put in place at the nursing home in Mecheknadaš, the hospital in Bonjad, as well as social institutions on account of the virus. The August 20th events have correspondingly been cancelled. The operative body is continually monitoring the pandemic situation. They continue to advise the public to be cautious. It was stressed in the statement that vigilance in terms of protection worked well in the first phase. In compliance with the rules, further restrictions may be avoided. Aside from smaller hotspots, the pandemic situation is favorable in Hungary, so the school year can begin as per usual. Schools are preparing nationwide. A detailed pandemic protocol has been worked out by the government. Soon, all schools will receive it. It gives useful tips to heads of institutions and teachers as to how to treat the situation and avoid the spread of the virus. Moreover, it provides precise rules tied to everyday teaching as well. The situations and the rules that must be complied with are summarized in eight pages. It pertains to the teachers and students, as well as the form of teaching, the subjects and sports, Miklos Kashlas said. The National Teachers Chamber supports the introduction of the pandemic protocol in schools. According to the director of the chamber, if rules are abided by, the school year can begin as usual and safely. Peter Horvat said in-school teaching is most important for those in their first year. They meet each other, the institution and the teachers for the first time, and clearly order must be established, which can solve issues in terms of teaching in a potential pandemic situation, Peter Horvat said. Digital teaching will only be introduced on a local level in the case of greater numbers of infections. Internet access will be free for teachers as well as students at schools that are affected. The roads narrowed due to bicycle lanes in Budapest are unsafe, an expert told N1 News. There are sections where the lane for cars is almost a meter narrower than required. The V4 International News Agency submitted a question to the presidential office of the European Parliament in respect of road lanes that are narrower than required by the specifications. The answer was that laws abide to all equally. The municipality of Budapest, headed by Mayor Gergely Karácsony, designated bicycle lanes on several roads of the capital by narrowing the traffic lanes. Cars can hardly have enough space to move next to Bikás Park, where buses and trucks can only maneuver by going over their lane on one side. The situation is similar on Budapest Road as well, where the traffic lanes have been narrowed by 180 centimeters for bicycle lanes. This is almost one meter less than the standard. This is not right according to traffic safety. It's dangerous for the cyclists and causes traffic jam for the drivers, Miklos Saka said. The V4 International News Agency asked the presidential office of the European Parliament about the narrower than standard lanes. The answer was that laws abide to all, regardless of the political majority. In an interview to M1 News, constitutional lawyer Zoltán Lomnici Jr. said that the leadership of Budapest had violated the laws of Hungary with narrowing the traffic lanes. The mayoral decisions regarding the bicycle lanes haven't been thought through well. They are, in a sense, harmful for the citizens of Budapest. And we can declare that the revision of these decisions has become divisible. If the EU identifies an infringement, it's evident that further proceedings will take place, the constitutional lawyer explained. We asked the municipality of Budapest why they developed such narrow lanes and whether they find them dangerous and also if they are planning to review the current situation. As an answer, they wrote, the application of the road technical specifications are only mandatory regarding national roads, however, on public roads they are only recommended. They noted that within professional circles, it's clear that narrow traffic lanes have a speed-reducing effect and that there are positive experiences with narrow lanes. 
The National Gal will be organized under strict regulations this year. The preliminary races will kick off in Dienesh this Sunday, and Hero Square will host the finals of the biggest horse race of the Carpathian Basin on the 10th and the 11th of October. It is still a question whether spectators will be allowed to attend the event. In this regard, a decision will be made later in cooperation with the operative body. The organizers say security is the most important this year. Last year, equestrian sports were at the forefront at Hero Square for two days on the race course that was set up there. Five competitors raced for the final prize. Following a tight race, Arnold Knight from Temerin and Voivodina won with his horse named Fantasia. The national gallop will be held this year as well. However, it will be a bit different this year as per the coronavirus pandemic. For example, the qualifying rounds will be held in fewer locations and at later dates. The first qualifying round will take place in Yenashdiash on August the 16th. The riders can show their skills at eight settlements. The top 72 will then go on to the next round in Budapest this October. One settlement is for sure. Temerin that has been the winner of the national gallop in the past two years, Kristof Sotjarinait said. Last year, thousands cheered on the racers. As of now, it is still uncertain as to whether there will be spectators on the spot or not. The director of the National Gallop spoke of how they are continually being informed about the current status of the coronavirus. They will make decisions in accordance with government regulations. Vilmos Lazar added, this year's safety is the most important. Currently, I cannot say what the situation will be like, but the National Gallop will be held, with spectators or without if there are no changes that would stand in the way of this event, Vilmos Lazar said. According to plans, in addition to national races, there will also be an international race this year as well. There will also prospectively be a chariot race and a little Hussas gallop as well. The 13th National Gallop Finals will take place from October the 10th to the 11th at Hero Square in Budapest. More and more people visit the Boradla Cave in Oktelek. Hungary's most famous natural formation is loved by many because even in the heat wave, there is only 10 degrees Celsius deep in the cave system, so nature lovers can cool off in the summer as well. Visiting the dripstone columns, varied both in form and color, is also a great experience for children. Deshada is not only a great natural place for swimming, but also the best fishing lake in the neighborhood of Kaposvár. It is Hungary's longest artificial lake. Visitors can cycle around the water, and the beach valuable lovers are also welcome here. Those interested can get to know the wildlife along the nearby hiking trails as well. And that's all for now, but we'll be back tomorrow night at around the same time, and you can catch Hungary reports online as well. Please stay tuned for our German, Russian and Chinese language news. Thanks for watching. Take care. Good night.